Okay, I bought some sealed boosters off eBay, not knowing that sealed boosters can be weighed, and in particular Japanese sealed boosters. So in here there's there's three English booster packs, and then there's another 14 Japanese booster packs in here. So I'm going to go through and see if it is true that buying stuff off eBay is bad and you're only ever going to get rubbish. Okay, reverse hollow diglet, Sarina, that's a good one. Okay. So pretty standard. the video the code card so okay there's an hollow oh hello it's not got a hollow and a reverse hollow energy okay so that was slightly better that one okay third pack Take the code out. Okay, so we got reverse hello Gathoria, another Serena Energy. Okay, yeah, so those darkness blaze packs weren't great. We got so now let's try the Japanese stuff. Okay, so we've got one, two, got four V Max, and then I've got some four V Max. I've got some three twenty first, twenty fifth anniversary, and then I've got some other random ones. So, so if the stories are to be believed, I'll try the V Max first. Okay, so straight off the bat, shiny energy. A hollow. Another hollow. Oh, look at that! Okay, so this pack's doing pretty well. And another hollow. That's the reverse hollow. This is a good pack. I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot. Okay, so straight away. It's fair to say, Japanese packs are okay. Okay, another shiny hollow. Maybe, because I don't know much about Pokemon cards, maybe all Japanese VMAX packs look like this, and this is in fact a dud, but it doesn't look like a dud. Look at that, full art. I don't even know which way up that is. Oh my god, another one. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with this. Okay, I mean... Is it legit? Can it be that good? Are they all that good? Who knows? I'm going to have to go and look at some VMAX card don't we, packs online see if they're all this full of shiny stuff. Shiny NG, you know? Okay, so a hollow one of them, a hollow one of them, a V one of them, and a hollow one of them, so it's pretty good. Okay, one last V Max. Okay, 
shiny energy. Keep hold of it. Okay, we're gonna hollow one of them. One of them. A full art. No, not full art, but a shiny one of them. A V. No. Oh, that's pretty cool, man. I do like these Japanese bags. Okay. Right. They're probably gonna be pretty interesting. So I'm gonna try some of the random ones first. Save the 25th anniversary ones till last. Okay, that one wasn't very exciting. Let's just check the backs of these. Yeah, fair enough. Okay, full art, shiny one of them. Cool. I'm gonna sleeve some of these up soon. see some shiny stuff. Okay, that one's interesting. It's got a hollow there. So these aren't too bad, these packs. Not been... I was expecting them to have absolutely nothing in them. Done okay so far. Okay, nothing much in that one. Got one last, no, no, two more. Two more standard packs to go. Okay, not a lot in there. Okay, so the last of the sort of ordinary boosters, and then we'll go on to the anniversary sets. Should have a bit more in there. Okay, that's pretty good. Yes, we did all right on the last one. So not too bad, not amazing, but really happy with the VMAX ones. Okay, first anniversary set.
Okay, so shiny energy, shiny, shiny. V, one of them. Okay, so they were all pretty spangly. I like those. Because uh, these are all anniversary reprints, I don't actually know how much these are going to be worth. I suspect it's less than, say, an original version of the counterparts. Okay, it's a nice artwork, but again, not really any idea how much any of those are worth. Okay, that looks pretty good. I bet that's worth a bit. Oh, and another Pikachu. Okay, I'm pretty happy with that. I've got two shiny Pikachus. 